Salutations, welcome to the travel part 4. We are now in the month of November. Um, last month we uh, managed to pick up some valuable points, uh, scored some goals, and Thierry Henry is in the form of his life. So hopefully this month um, it's more of the same or even better. So um, let's move on to the next event. Okay, so the objective is to win by two goals. Now I think we've reached the halfway point of the group stage. So um, we need those three points to qualify. There's no place like home. No, they were really looking forward to playing in front of their own fans again. And Andy, they're responding accordingly. Yeah, they are. Of course, after a couple of tough away matches, Clive, it's always nice to be back on your own stomping ground. He'll have a go. Great reflexes, just got his fingertips to it. Jungberg, guided in high. Wasn't the best of tackles, it's a foul, but uh, no card. He's having a crack. Oh, it's there! Goal. He hasn't got a chance with that one. He's never going to leap up there and stop that. That goal just nudges the temperature of the game up a little. Knocked downfield. All square at half time here. It's 1 1. And the referee's reaching for a card. decides the challenge from behind is worthy of a yellow card he's just got to cool down a little bit if he's not careful he'll get a red card next time he's having a crack it was a terrific free kick a match by a terrific save can he cross that's a useful cross and that's over the bar and out the uh, goalkeeper untroubled Kick hit long. It has finished as it started with nothing to divide these two teams. I think I know which manager will be the more disappointed, although a draw was probably fair enough in the end. Two tough teams who know how to play the game. I enjoyed that, Clive. That was good stuff. Well worth watching. Appreciate you being with us again. Clive Tilsey here with uh, Andy Townsend saying bye bye for now. I hate it when it's scripted like that. But at the moment, we are on 7 points, so yeah, we still got a good chance of qualifying to the next round. I'm, I'm not worried about it. Okay, so the next match is against uh, our London rival, Chelsea. So uh, it should be a good game. The objectives for this game is to not play Thierry Henry, Thomas Rizisky, and Colo Toure. Now, now, that's a really dumb move. But since uh, the chairman is my employer, I have to listen to what he says. Senderos getting one or two dirty looks from teammates after that one. He's sliding in, but he didn't get the ball. Oh, he got a bit carried away there, a bit excited, I think. He'll have a go. It's there. So classy in front of goal. And they are starting to build an unassailable lead. 
Gilberto. Half time, and the score is 2 0. Adebayor. This is a chance. He's given it. It's a penalty. Didn't think twice about it. Well, you work so hard to get yourself in a good situation in the game, and then you do something stupid and concede a penalty. Now, how are your nerves? Scores! That could be costly. And a by all. And a free kick given by the referee. Well, they practice these day in, day out on the training ground. Now, can they make it count here? He's having a go. Oh, he's tucked it away! Well, he struck that beautifully. That's gone right in the top corner. Goalkeeper can't get anywhere near it. Well, you've got to be prepared to miss in order to score, they say. And he has missed a few. Well, that's a good pass. He's given it. Point straight to the spot. I think this team needs to have a good look at the way they're defending here today. That's another penalty, and that's just not good enough. Not acceptable. Got the right makeup for a penalty taker. Oh, what a great save! Kept out by the goalkeeper. Time on the ball. Now, can he get across in here? Can he get a shot in? It's in. He's done. important now this team can get the ball back from that kickoff as soon as they can they've got to get possession again him at first you don't succeed and he has tried and tried again it's been a very very interesting game three two here at the final whistle well, that's a sweet victory. I tell you what, those players will be loving that in the dressing room right now. When you pinch a goal late on like that, it's a good feeling. You could tell that the game actually wanted me to lose, but I really wasn't in the mood for that. All it took was some uh, magic from Robin Van Persie. So uh, we got the win. Okay, so the next match is against Celtic in the Champions League. The objective is to change formation during match. Okay. Well, this may be the very best or the very worst of times to be visiting this stadium. As you probably read, the coach here lost his job last week, but then They've not been at their most consistent either, Andy. There may be another nervous coach here, you know. Well, have you know the business. If you don't deliver the results, you're not going to be around for very long. Now, it looks as if the home team have surprised the visitors a wee bit tonight with their lineup, And it'd be very interesting to see how the visitors respond. Yeah. Shoots. Great reflexes from the keeper. Adebayo. Adebayo. Clear chance. It's in. That is. What a great goal! No keeper in the world could have done anything about that. He's through. Has a go. Didn't. Oh, yes, he's there. This guy's one of the very best in the business. Wouldn't that sort of range? And they are starting to build an unassailable lead. That's half time. We'll be back for the second half. It's 2 0 here. Get a shot in, Kenny. I'll tell you something, that's a very, very good save. Men sweeping out left and right. Here he comes. Henri. Is this the chance? Ramerson. Well, they've done it. They are not letting go of the Champions League trophy without a struggle, are they, Andy? Not at all, Clive. You know what? Qualifying out of the group stage is all about getting results, and they've done that here again. I tell you what, you'd love to be a striker in this team. You know you'll get chances, and when you look back, you see a back four that just doesn't give anything away. 
I did change formation during the match to a 4-4-2 diamond. So uh, yeah, you know, in case you guys wanted to know. Right, we're gonna skip this match against Sheffield United. A three three draw. Okay. And um apparently Doyle, the youth player guy, got a hat trick. Interesting. A new star is born. I, I think I see where this is going. We're probably gonna have to play this guy in the next match. Yep. Uh we have to put him on the pitch for ninety minutes. Basically he has to start the game and finish the game. One or two substitutes were warming up during the half-time interval. What, if anything, have the two managers been looking to change? Henri has to shoot. He's given it. Points to the spot. It was a tackle from behind. Well, you work so hard to get yourself in a good situation in the game and then you do something stupid and concede a penalty. Now, how are your nerves? Blocks the shot. It's in the net! You really expect him to miss? No chance. That is what you call a counter-attack. The length of the field in no time at all. there and I don't mind that he's given the foul now when you get into these sort of errors you must hit the target he's having a crack oh yes you give this better an opportunity and he'll bury it that's two goals for him now it's just so difficult to keep quiet he's kept it in no foul given there Oh, he is a goalkeeper of real courage, this one. Now, can he put it away? What a goal! Well, he's been so lively today, and he deserves his goals, and I wouldn't be surprised to see him get more. Trying to break free of the uh, cover. Well, wouldn't you just know it, after his astounding hat-trick last time out, the new young star continues to amaze and excite. Another win and another thrilling display. Clyde, this boy just gets better and better. And the bigger the game, the more he likes it. Now, surely they're going to play him in the closing group match of the Champions League. So, Doyle got another goal. But, uh, to be honest, I don't rate him. He's not first team quality yet. Okay, so for this match... We have to play both Doyle and Adebayo, which leaves no room for Thierry Henry unless I change the formation. So, um, yeah, you know, I don't like how they uh, hype up this Doyle guy, you know. That's how a lot of youngsters that break through into the first team fail in real life. Because, you know, there were just too much hype. This game is almost a sideshow to all the rumours and speculations surrounding just two men. What is going on between them? What have you heard, Andy? Well, this young fella's been so impressive, Clive. It's no wonder that people are starting to get a little bit envious. The manager's got to sort that out. He's got to keep that spirit in the dressing room just right. The referee gets the match underway. Got a chance to run with the ball again. Possibilities here. Oh, what a goal! It's a really bright start to this game, but they have to keep pushing men forward. They've got to keep getting in that box. He doesn't know how to spray the ball about. And a by all. What a goal! You 
train all week and then your goalie goes and does something like that. They are not showing any mercy. They want as many goals as they can get. Senderos. And when he get in dangerous area. Extraordinary! That's a great finish. He didn't lash it. He just controlled it and tucked it right in the corner. It's a goal that has put this match right back in the balance. Doyle. It's a cross. That was dangerous, but they managed to deal with it. The first half comes to a close. And the score is 2-1. Can he score? Fantastic save. This goal is kind of some player. What a terrific save. Fires one in. Oh, yes, there's the equaliser. That's a beautifully controlled finish. He's really struck that hard and low. Goalkeeper hasn't got a chance with that one. And the referee will be totting up these fouls in his mind. Going for goal. Oh, that was close. I bet he's been putting him in all week on the training ground, but when it mattered, he couldn't find it. Get it upfield. Full time. Not the result they wanted at all. Only a draw. Well, again, it was another interesting game, you know, but that team should have won that. They know they missed a lot of chances out there. That game was uh, scripted because um, the two goals that we conceded, well, um, I don't know. I feel I felt like it could have been avoided, especially the second goal. It was a header from outside the box. How do you concede a goal from a header outside the box? It it doesn't make sense. I mean, if the keeper moved a bit, maybe you know, run towards the ball, he could have gotten it, and it wouldn't have been a goal. But, you know, uh, that's the result, so we move on. December is a squeaky bum time, as Sir Alex Ferguson used to call it. So, uh, this next part should be very interesting. Uh, so, the next match is against uh, Ajax in the Champions League. The final game of the Champions League, and I think all we need is just, you know, a draw. And um, so, no pressure. So um, I'll be ending the video here. Uh, thank you for watching and um, I'll see you next time. Bye bye.